Peugeot is one of the oldest automotive brands in the world, founded in 1810. The Peugeot brand originally started as a manufacturer of coffee mills and bicycles before entering the automotive industry. The company's first car, the Peugeot Type 3, was produced in 1891. Peugeot is a French car manufacturer headquartered in Paris. The iconic lion emblem of Peugeot represents strength, resilience, and durability. Peugeot is part of the Stellantis Automotive Group, formed in 2021 through the merger of Fiat Chrysler Automobiles and PSA Group. Peugeot's lineup includes a variety of vehicles, including compact cars, sedans, SUVs, and vans. The Peugeot 208 is one of the brand's best-selling models, known for its stylish design and efficient engines. Peugeot has a rich motorsport history, including successes in rallying and endurance racing. The Peugeot 205 GTI is considered one of the greatest hot hatches of all time, cherished by enthusiasts for its agility and performance. The Peugeot 504 is one of the brand's most iconic models, renowned for its robustness and reliability, particularly in Africa. Peugeot introduced its first electric car, the Peugeot Ion, in 2010. The Peugeot 3008 has won numerous awards, including the European Car of the Year in 2017. Peugeot has a strong presence in the commercial vehicle market with models like the Peugeot Expert and Peugeot Boxer. The Peugeot 106. Rally is a sought-after classic among rally enthusiasts, prized for its lightweight design and nimble handling. Peugeot has a commitment to sustainability, with initiatives like reducing emissions and offering electrified powertrains. The Peugeot 404, produced from 1960 to 1975, was a popular family car known for its comfort and durability. Peugeot's concept cars, like the E-Legend and Quartz, showcase the brand's vision for the future of automotive design and technology. The Peugeot 508 SW was named the most beautiful car of the year in 2019 at the International Automobile Festival. Peugeot has a strong global presence with manufacturing facilities and sales operations in numerous countries, the Peugeot 908 HDI FAP won the 24 Hours of Le Mans in 2009, highlighting Peugeot's engineering prowess in endurance racing. Peugeot offers a range of innovative technologies in its vehicles, including the Peugeot iCockpit infotainment system. The Peugeot 607 was the official presidential car of France from 2000 to 2010. Peugeot's current CEO is Linda Jackson, the first woman to lead the brand. The Peugeot 504 Coupe and Convertible are admired for their elegant design and timeless style. Peugeot has a strong presence in emerging markets, with a focus on expanding its footprint in regions like Asia and Africa. The Peugeot 302, introduced in 1936, was one of the brand's early successes, known for its advanced features and comfortable ride. Peugeot has a long-standing partnership with Total Energies, collaborating on research and development in areas like fuel efficiency and lubricants. The Peugeot 908 RC concept car, unveiled in 2006, showcased Peugeot's vision for luxury and refinement in a flagship sedan. Peugeot's brand values include innovation, quality, and French flair. The Peugeot E2008 is an all-electric SUV offering zero-emission driving without compromising on style or performance. Peugeot has a strong presence in the compact crossover segment with models like the Peugeot 2008. The Peugeot 504 pickup truck is a popular choice for commercial use in markets around the world. Peugeot's design philosophy emphasizes clean lines, dynamic proportions, and attention to detail. The Peugeot 301 is a compact sedan designed for urban mobility and practicality. Peugeot has a history of collaboration with other automakers, including partnerships with Citroën and Renault. The Peugeot 4007 was the brand's first SUV, offering versatile performance and off-road capability. Peugeot's research and development efforts focus on enhancing safety, connectivity, and sustainability in its vehicles.
The Peugeot RCZ, a sleek and sporty coupe, won numerous awards for its design and driving dynamics. Peugeot's heritage collection includes iconic models like the Peugeot 203 and Peugeot 405. Peugeot's manufacturing facilities adhere to strict quality standards to ensure reliability and durability in its vehicles. The Peugeot 5008 is a spacious and versatile SUV designed for family adventures and everyday practicality. Peugeot has a strong presence in the compact van segment with models like the Peugeot Partner, Peugeot's brand ambassadors include athletes, artists, and influencers who embody the spirit of the Lion emblem. The Peugeot 607 Feline concept car, unveiled in 2004, showcased cutting-edge technology and luxurious amenities. Peugeot's design studio, located in Velizy, France, is responsible for creating the brand's distinctive styling language. Peugeot's commitment to customer satisfaction is reflected in its extensive warranty and service offerings. The Peugeot 504 Cabriolet is a rare and collectible model sought after by enthusiasts and collectors. Peugeot's partnership with the FIA Formula E Championship highlights its dedication to electric mobility and sustainable racing. Peugeot continues to innovate and evolve, embracing new technologies and trends to shape the future of mobility. Citroën was founded in 1919 by André Citroën. The company's first mass-produced car was the Citroën Type A. Citroën is a French automobile manufacturer. The Citroën logo features two chevrons, which represent the company's early history as a gear manufacturer. Citroën has sold over 50 million vehicles worldwide since its inception. A Citroën was the first car to cross the Sahara in 1923. Citroën has been part of the PSA group, now Stellantis, since 1976. Citroën is known for its innovative engineering and avant-garde designs. The Citroën Traction Avant, introduced in 1934, was one of the first mass-produced front-wheel drive cars. Citroën's largest market is Europe, with France being its primary market. The Citroën 2CV, launched in 1948, became an iconic symbol of French automotive culture. Citroën has won numerous awards for its car designs over the years. The Citroën DS, introduced in 1955, was praised for its futuristic design and advanced technology. The DS was famously driven by French presidents and celebrities. Citroën played a significant role in the development of hydropneumatic suspension technology. The Citroën GS, launched in 1970, featured the company's unique hydropneumatic suspension system. Citroën's iconic H-Van, introduced in 1947, became popular as a commercial vehicle. Citroën has a rich motorsport heritage, including success in events like the World Rally Championship. The Citroën SM, launched in 1970, was a luxury Grand Tourer featuring a Maserati engine. Citroën introduced the iconic Citroën CX in 1974, known for its aerodynamic design and advanced features. The Citroën Visa, launched in 1978, was a popular compact car known for its practicality. Citroën has over 10,000 sales and service outlets worldwide, ensuring accessibility to customers in various regions. Citroën launched the XM in 1989, a luxury executive car featuring advanced technology. Citroën introduced the quirky Citroën Berlingo in 1996, a pioneering leisure activity vehicle. The Citroën C3, launched in 2002, became popular for its distinctive styling and comfort. Citroën's luxury segment expanded with the introduction of the Citroën C6 in 2005. Citroën has a strong presence in the electric vehicle market, with models like the Citroën C0. The Citroën C4 Picasso, introduced in 2006, became popular for its spacious interior and practicality. Citroën's DS line was revived in 2009 as a premium sub-brand, offering distinctive luxury vehicles. Citroën introduced the C3 Picasso in 2008, a compact MPV known for its versatility. The Citroën DS3, launched in 2010, brought a new level of style and customization to the compact car segment. 
Citroën entered the crossover market with the introduction of the Citroën C4 Cactus in 2014. The Citroën C4 Cactus featured innovative air bump panels to protect against minor impacts. Citroën introduced the C3 Air Cross in 2017, a compact SUV with customizable color options. The Citroën C5 Air Cross, launched in 2018, offers comfort and versatility in the mid-size SUV segment. Citroën has a strong presence in the commercial vehicle market with models like the Citroën Jumpy. The Citroën Space Tourer, introduced in 2016, offers spacious seating and modular design for families and businesses. Citroën's racing division, Citroën Racing, has achieved success in various motorsport disciplines. Citroën has a commitment to sustainability, with initiatives to reduce emissions and improve fuel efficiency. Citroën has a global presence, with manufacturing facilities and sales networks in numerous countries. The Citroën Ami, introduced in 2020, is an electric microcar designed for urban mobility. Citroën has embraced digital technology, offering online sales and connectivity features in its vehicles. Citroën has a long history of producing iconic advertising campaigns capturing the imagination of audiences. The Citroën GS Birotor, introduced in 1973, featured a Wankel rotary engine, but was discontinued due to reliability issues. Citroën has collaborated with fashion designers and artists to create limited edition vehicles. Citroën's concept cars showcase the company's vision for the future of automotive design and technology. Citroën has a strong commitment to safety, with advanced driver assistance systems in many of its vehicles. Citroën's heritage is celebrated through events like Citroën Centenary Celebrations and Vintage Car Rallies. Citroën continues to innovate with initiatives like Citroën Advanced Comfort, focusing on enhancing the driving experience. Citroën's legacy as a pioneering automotive brand continues to influence the industry with its bold designs and innovative technologies. The French trio Peugeot, Citroën, and now it's time for 50 facts about Renault, was founded on February 25, 1899, by Louis Renault and his brothers Marcel and Fernand. The company's first car, the Renault Voiturette 1CV, was sold to a friend of Louis Renault's father on December 24, 1898. Renault is headquartered in boulogne billancourt France. The Renault logo, a diamond shape, has been in use since 1925. Renault's production facilities are spread across 27 countries. It is one of the oldest automobile manufacturers in the world. Renault's alliance with Nissan and Mitsubishi, known as the Renault-Nissan-Mitsubishi Alliance, is one of the largest automotive partnerships globally. Renault has a significant presence in Formula One, having competed as a constructor since 1977. The Renault F1 team has won multiple Formula One constructors' championships and drivers' championships. In 1999, Renault acquired a controlling stake in the Romanian automaker Dacia, which has since become a subsidiary. Renault has a strong focus on electric vehicles, EVs, and was one of the pioneers in the EV market with models like the Renault Zoe. The Renault-Nissan Alliance introduced the first mass-market electric vehicle, the Nissan LEAF, in 2010. Renault's EV sales have steadily increased over the years, making it one of the leading EV manufacturers in Europe. Renault also produces commercial vehicles, including vans and trucks, under the Renault Trucks brand. The Renault Group consists of several brands, including Renault, Dacia, Alpine, and Renault Samsung Motors. The Renault Twingo, introduced in 1992, is one of Renault's popular city cars. Renault's presence in motorsport extends beyond Formula One to other racing series, including rally racing and endurance racing. The Renault Capture is one of the best-selling compact SUVs in Europe. Renault's global sales network spans over 130 countries. The Renault Kajar is a crossover SUV that competes in the highly competitive compact SUV segment. The Renault Scenic, introduced in 1996, was one of the first compact MPVs, multi-purpose vehicles. Renault has a long history of innovation, including the introduction of turbocharged engines in Formula One. Renault's design headquarters are located in Guyancourt, France. The Renault Espace, launched in 1984, is one of the first modern European MPVs. Renault's involvement in motorsport has contributed to the development of advanced automotive technologies. 
Renault's global sales exceeded 3.7 million vehicles in 2019. Renault has a significant presence in emerging markets, including India, Brazil, and Russia. Renault owns a stake in the Chinese automaker Dongfeng Motor Corporation. The Renault Kangoo is a popular compact panel van used for commercial purposes. Renault's electric vehicle lineup includes models like the Renault Tweezy, a compact urban EV. The Renault Megane, introduced in 1995, is a compact car available in various body styles. Renault's production facilities adhere to strict environmental standards, with efforts focused on sustainability and reducing carbon emissions. The Renault Clio, first introduced in 1990, is one of Renault's best-selling models. Renault's involvement in motorsport includes successful participation in endurance races like the 24 Hours of Le Mans. Renault sponsors various sports events and teams, including football clubs and cycling teams. The Renault Talisman is a mid-sized sedan designed for comfort and luxury. Renault has a strong presence in the compact hatchback segment with models like the Renault Symbol. The Renault Traffic is a popular mid-sized van used for both commercial and passenger transport. Renault's commitment to electric mobility includes initiatives to expand charging infrastructure. The Renault-Nissan-Mitsubishi Alliance is focused on developing autonomous driving technologies. Renault's corporate social responsibility efforts include initiatives to promote road safety and support local communities. The Renault Master is a large van available in various configurations to suit different cargo needs. Renault has a partnership with Waymo, a subsidiary of Alphabet Inc., to develop autonomous mobility services. Renault's design philosophy emphasizes a balance between functionality and aesthetic appeal. The Renault Twisi is a compact electric city car designed for urban mobility. Renault's lineup includes models with alternative fuel options, including hybrid and plug-in hybrid vehicles. The Renault Laguna, produced from 1993 to 2015, was a popular mid-size family car. Renault participates in various sustainability initiatives, including reducing water consumption and waste generation in its production processes. The Renault Arcana is a compact crossover coupe that blends SUV practicality with coupe-inspired design elements. Renault's vision for the future includes continued investment in electric and autonomous technologies to shape the future of mobility.